All right, so I rewired this uh, motor earlier today, and I just kind of want to show you guys exactly what I did. It was easier to show you guys after I did it rather than let you guys watch me actually twist the wires together. Um, I did have a few small issues with the wires. Um, a couple of them had to be kind of cut and trimmed a little bit but I got it all wired up and I'm gonna show you exactly what I did. Okay, so as you can see, like I mentioned before, okay, you have this diagram on here. So we can wire this motor from 115 to 230, okay? And what I did is I rewired it from 230 to 115, okay? now getting close to this um, diagram here, okay, you can see high voltage and low voltage. This is the 230 and this is the 115, okay? So the way I had it bef wired before was on high with uh, line and line, okay? So I had my hot on T4 and T5, and the neutral on T1, and then T3, 8, and 2 were taped together, okay? So I have it wired now for, uh, I got my hot wire, the black one going into T2, T4, and T5. We come over here to the wiring, okay, and you can see my black wire coming in, and I have that on T... 5, T4, and T2. Get that so you guys can see that. Okay, T2, T4, and T5. Okay, T2, T4, and T5. And then I have my neutral going into T1, T3, and T8. So we come over here to the wiring. You can see my white wire going in. Okay, there's T1, T3, and T8. So we go back over here, okay, T1, T3, and T8, okay? So you'll just have to remember that when you rewire one of these motors, you'll have to use a uh, different size wire nut. Because so I had some wire nuts uh, this size, when I had it wired before, but since I have my hot wire going in, we got three wires, um, you'll have to use a larger sized wire nut. And then while I'm in here, I'll show you how I got my ground hooked up. Okay, so you got the ground coming out of the cord, got that connected with a wire nut, and the ground just goes right back in there. So, and then it also says on here too, um, on here somewhere, yep, grounding, right there. So, I just wanted to make this video because I've had uh, some comments on a few of my other videos on motors that I rewired. And um, uh, to all my viewers, they uh, commented back that, you know, things weren't very clear. Um, the wiring wasn't really in detail, so I just figured I'd cover that a little bit better with this motor here and actually show you guys the numbering on the leads along with the numbering on the uh, on that wire wiring diagram there. So I hope this helped somebody out. Um, if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. If not, give it a thumbs down. And if you haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and do so. Uh, don't forget to leave a comment and hit the little bell in the corner so you'll be notified when I upload a new video. All right, I hope this helps somebody out. Thanks for watching.